If you see a large telescope at night, you'll often see orange laser beams pointing out of the dome. Astronomers have turned to a method called adaptive optics. Sophisticated deformable mirrors controlled by computers that can correct in real time the distortion caused by the turbulence or twinkling of the Earth's atmosphere. Adaptive optics require a fairly bright reference star that is very close to the object under study. High up in the atmosphere is a layer that can be excited to glow by the single wavelength light of an orange sodium laser. This artificial star made by the laser twinkles in the distortion of the Earth's atmosphere. These distortions are measured in real time and a negative pattern of movement produced. This inverted twinkle can be used to distort a thin metal mirror. At the back of the mirror are electric magnets a bit like a sound coil inside a loudspeaker. Hundreds of these bend tiny parts of the mirror, distorting its shape and cancelling out the twinkle. Light from a star near the laser can now be seen in much greater clarity. The latest adaptive optical telescopes are 10 times sharper than the Hubble Space Telescope. This is both because on the ground they can have a larger mirror, so gather more light, and they can now eliminate most of the twinkle in the Earth's atmosphere using adaptive optics. The world's largest telescope, the TMT, or 30-meter telescope, is about to be built on top of a mountain in Hawaii called Mauna Kea. The TMT will have 492 segmented mirrors this will make it nine times the power of the Keck, which is currently the world's largest telescope. And we'll use the latest generation of the Laser Guide Star Adaptive Optics System. Keep your eyes on the skies, the truth is out there. <laughs>